And now, aviation weather around Alaska. All right, for flying weather, Wednesday morning, a lot of IFR, central southern Bering Sea down across the Aleutians, right on up into the Alaska Peninsula to southwest Kodiak Island, and across uh, Togiak Bay there, Cape Newenham, to just near Dillingham there into the uh, Southwest Hills, and a little bit here over the Yukon Delta, a little IFR along the southern slopes of the Central Brooks Range. Otherwise, the North Slope and Arctic Coast looking pretty good, as well as the interior. Marginal VFR, North Gulf Coast, up into uh, Southern Copper River Basin, as well as Cook Inlet, and then up over the uh, Western Alaska Range and the Southeast Coast, pretty marginal. And then some IFR shows up Wednesday afternoon here from Yakutat over into Lynn Canal area and marginal VFR all the way down to Dixon entrance. Marginal for the Kenai Peninsula, Prince William Sound, Susitna Valley, northward to the Arctic coast, VFR, marginal VFR, Seward Peninsula, Yukon Cuscom Delta down into Bristol Bay. Some IFR there on the east side of Kodiak Island and IFR holding from the Perbolofs down to Adak and Atka on out to the west. And for the morning hours Thursday, good VFR in the interior. Seward Peninsula right over into the Yukon. Marginal VFR along and south of the Alaska Range here into South Central Alaska. Kodiak Island, Bristol Bay, Southwest uh, coastal areas there. IFR still from near Nunavak Island across the Pribilofs down to the east or just about all the Aleutians. Marginal VFR for the Northern Bering Sea. And some IFR here for the Eastern Panhandle up into Lincoln Isle Glacier Bay and along the uh, coast range. And from there for the afternoon, that goes away, just leaving marginal VFR behind, pretty widespread over the Panhandle into the Gulf of Alaska to Prince William Sound, becoming VFR, Cook Inlet, uh, and the Susitna Valley. And for the Northern Copper River Basin, all the way up to the uh, North Slope, looks uh, good, VFR flying, Western Arctic coast wide open, Marginal on the east side, Bering Sea now, mostly marginal VFR again into the Yukon Cusquam Delta. IFR now retreating southward here to uh, most of the Aleutians. Passes for tomorrow, Anatuvik and Adigan, both VFR. And for Lake Clark and Merrill, marginal VFR at times throughout the day on Wednesday. Rainy, optimistically, call it VFR. And windy VFR, Isabel, VFR flying there. And for Mentasta, conditions looking good. Tanita, though, occasionally marginal for the day on Wednesday. Portage, mostly marginal. Chilkoot and White, uh, IFR. Freezing levels here, coldest air back up over the Russian Far East now into the Bering Strait, about 2,000 feet there. Otherwise, uh, four to 6,000 feet over the interior, six to 8,000 feet over the southeast coast, and then the Aleutians, around 12,000 feet. Icing, big area of rime icing coming into the uh, Aleutians here, sliding eastward to about Atka Island tomorrow afternoon. Otherwise, isolated moderate icing here along the west coast and with the uh, moisture from the northwest coast all the way down into Bristol Bay. And then a chance of some icing here, Isolated moderate for the Copper River Basin areas, Prince William Sound, gets a little heavier on down the southeast coast. And from there, looking at uh, jet stream weather or jet stream winds, westerlies uh, into the Queen Charlotte, it's about 100 knots there with the upper level low right off the southeast coast. And south to north flow here along the west coast, up to 90 knots across the Seward Peninsula. And then coming back around out of the north-northwest, they were from 90 to 105 knots in the Bering Sea. And for 9,000 feet, uh, northwest winds here across the Bering Sea down to the eastern Aleutians, 35 to 40 knots. Stronger uh, winds out over the western Aleutians at about 50 knots or so. And then south to north flow 30 to 40 knots over the western interior. Light over the central and east side into the Gulf of Alaska. South winds 30 knots there for the southern panhandle. And at 9,000 feet, light winds for the southeast coast into the Gulf, central, eastern interior. Narrow band of 25 to 30 knot winds here over the western interior areas from Shelikoff Strait. That's where they'll be the strongest at about 30 knots there in Bristol Bay. Otherwise, northwest winds just south of the western Aleutians there at about 50 knots. Taking a look at uh, turbulence. 
with those stronger winds, uh, isolated moderate turbulence there from uh, roughly near Adak back to Shimianat 2, and also a band here from the western Arctic coast, Point Lay over to Point Hope, southward across eastern Norton Sound, Bristol Bay, on into Kodiak Island. Not too bad elsewhere around the state.